Kingdom Blessings. I'm Pastor Sheila. Are you ready to be blessed and refreshed? Well, come on. It's time for Moet Sharada. Let's go to the Word of God. from Psalm 9, verses 1 to 3. I'm reading from the Life Application Study Bible. It says, I will thank you, Lord, with all my heart. I will tell of all the marvelous things you have done. I will be filled with joy because of you. I will sing praises to your name, O Most High. My enemies turn away in retreat. They are overthrown and destroyed before you. For you have judged in my favor. From your throne, you have judged with fairness. And the note says, Praise is expressing to God our appreciation and understanding of his worth. It is saying thank you for each aspect of his divine nature. Our inward attitude becomes outward expression. When we praise God, we help ourselves by expanding our awareness of who he is. In each psalm you read, look for an attribute or characteristic of God for which you can thank him. Beloved, my dear brothers and sisters, I want you to be encouraged today to thank God with all your heart. Begin to talk about the marvelous things that he has done for you. Begin to be filled with the joy. So once you start thinking about all that God has done, you'll be filled with joy. And you'll want to sing praises unto our God, O Most High. I'm excited about the part that says, My enemies turn away and retreat. So beloveds, whatever is after you or trying to take you down, when God shows up on the scene, when God stands up, oh my God, the enemies get scared and they turn around and they retreat. And it says that they're overthrown and they're destroyed before our God. And I'm most excited about verse four. It says, for you have judged in my favor from your throne. You have judged with fairness. God is fair. (laughs) He judges us in our favor. I want you to know that God has made a judgment and it's in your favor. (laughs) The enemy has brought up charges, but God has put forth a judgment and it's in your favor. The devil comes... He's the accuser of the brethren. But God looks. And Jesus Christ is our, he is the one that defends us. And he brings into evidence the blood that was shed for us. And no matter what the enemy tries to come and bring up, the verdict is in our favor. I want you to be encouraged today, hallelujah, to know that the verdict is in your favor. The verdict is in your favor. Our king has given the verdict. He's given his ruling and it's in your favor. Hallelujah. Come on, let's pray. Father, Father, in that matchless, wonderful, honorable name of Jesus Christ, Yeshua, Son of the living God, Father, we just come before you thanking you, praising you, glorifying your name because you are so good. Your mercy is everlasting. Your truth endures to all generations. Father, oh God, we just love you and we bless you. Thank you for your word. Father, we repent of our sins. Have mercy upon us, oh God. According to thy love and kindness, according to thy multitude of grace and mercy, Blot out our transgressions, O oh God. Forgive us of every sin, every wrong thought, evil deed. Father, forgive us. 
Take out everything that's not like you, Lord God. For you are the potter and we are the clay. Mold us, make us, shape us, break us. Take out every stain, every wrinkle, every blemish, whatever's not like you. Take it out, God. We give you permission. For it is our desire. It is our desire to please you, God. It's our desire to be vessels of honor meet for your use. So, Father, we give you glory and honor and praise. Father, we thank you that you have pronounced the verdict. You've given the verdict, Lord. You've given the sentence, Lord. And your decision has come, and it's for our favor. You've done it in our favor, Lord God. And he whom the sun sets free is free indeed. God, we thank you. We appreciate you, Father. For what is man that thou art mindful of him? Oh, God, thank you. Thank you for loving us so much. Thank you for keeping us, Lord God. Thank you for life, health, and strength. Father, we say thank you. We say thank you for the activities of our limbs and the articulation of speech and being able to think mentally on our own, Father. Thank you. Thank you for releasing your angels and giving them charge over us to keep us lest we dash our foot against the stone. Thank you, Father. Thank you that your word is true. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for opening up the windows of heaven and pouring out blessings in which we don't have even room to receive. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Father. You're a good, good Father. And we bless your holy name. We give you all the glory, all the glory, all the honor in the mighty name of Yeshua. There's nobody like you, God. There's no one, nowhere that is like you, Father. Oh, God, there's nobody like you. Nobody like you, Jesus. Nobody like you. Oh, 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 hallelujah, we bless you, Jesus. Oh, 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 Jesus. Father, we love you. Father, we bless you. Father, we give you glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We love you. God, we love you. God, we love you. We love you. We love you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. We love you. Bless your name, God. Hallelujah, God. We love you. Bless you. Give you the glory and the honor. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Oh, God. We bless you. We love you, Jesus. Mm. So wonderful, God. Mm. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. We love you and bless you. 
you. We love you and we bless you. In the matchless name of Jesus. Amen and amen. Well, beloved, this has been Moet Show Raka, the appointed time of refreshing. Hallelujah. Continue to be blessed, revived, and refreshed in the presence of the Lord. Shalom. Thank you.